Plunder Panda is back to smash them kiddos. We get the GM Goof Master. Nice. I thought we were the goofy one. But uh, bro is the goofy one. No troubles for us. Bro pushes the pawn to e4. We push the pawn to e5. Uh, bro is a low elo dummy. Let's hop them ponies and save the pawn. We need to focus. Four pony business. I don't think he's going to go Halloween. Bro brings out the juicer. We can technically take there and uh, create a hot pot mess. But we'll bring out the juicer and just copy his homework. Try to keep it simple. The Italian life. He wanna pin? We wanna pin. He says no pinning, so we pin him. I guess he wants to push and kick us away. We don't care. We'll go back. Okay, big question. If we hop in the pony looking to be on the kid, he's gonna break and we can't sacrifice. So let's uh, maybe just push the pawn, say no pinning for him. He can push and kick us. So we are fine. We are juicers can go back. I really want to sacrifice. Let's uh, use a bit of a tomato brain. The sacrifice is a bit too much. It's ambitious. So let's say no to the sacrifice business. The problem with this is our juicer is sad. He hopped in the pony. Uh, we can trade them ponies. If he takes this, we can hop. No problem. He takes this way. No problem. Pinning winning is not a problem. Bring out the fairy queen. Attack the pony. Set up the scholars. If the pony tries to hop, he kicked us. Mm. But if I go back, we get nothing, right? So if you go to commit, we go to commit right now. This is the big brain move. Sacrificing the juicer. We win the pony back. He goes somewhere. He's fine. Uh, we can take it back. But so can he. And it's a mess. Bring on the mess. Tactical uh, sacrifice. Oh no. Fishy is like, what the fish? He talk. We take back. We threaten the scholars. We win the rook. We win the game. Game is over. I don't know what he did. I actually have no idea. Like, uh...